Pitcher Jose Barrios had a disastrous outing last week at the World Baseball Classic, allowing six runs on five hits and two walks in just over an inning of work for Puerto Rico. Welcome to our Toronto Blue Jays News Today channel. If you haven't done so yet, please subscribe and click on the bell to activate notifications, so you don't miss any new videos. If the same thing had happened during spring training in minor league play, it would not have been a big deal. However, Barrios was pitching in a meaningful game representing Puerto Rico in front of more than 35,000 spectators. Barrios wasn't on the mound to tinker mechanically or work on a pitch, he was trying to efficiently retire batters, and it couldn't have gone much worse. According to an article on Sportsnet, Barrios admitted that he and his teammates had to forget about working on whatever they wanted to work on in spring training, and instead had to pitch and compete. Barrios' fastball command has been a persistent issue, and his performance in the WBC only underlined that he needs to improve. Two of the five hits he allowed came off four-seam fastballs he threw up and over the plate against left-handed hitters. Barrios' four-seamer against lefties was hit .381 with a .752 slugging percentage last season. Although not all of his four-seamers to lefties were poorly located, at this level of competition, the margins are thin, and big league hitters are tremendously skilled. Another issue is Barrios' use of both of his fastballs, four-seamer and two-seamer, to right-handed hitters. Barrios peppered the inside edge of the plate over 80% of the time, which could cause problems for him in the future if not addressed. Despite his poor showing at the WBC, Barrios had a good outing in his first spring start since going back to the Jays, a 2-1 win over Baltimore on Wednesday. He threw 77 pitches, 47 strikes, over five and a half innings, allowing one run while striking out five. In some crucial counts, he achieved his stated objective of landing his fastball to the glove side, which he believes keeps his mechanics under control and keeps batters honest. Barrio said after the game that he never lost his confidence. I've worked incredibly hard during the offseason. Today I observed the excellent results I wish to achieve. My pitches went fairly well, and I feel strong and healthy. The next phase, according to pitching coach Pete Walker, is to carry this into the subsequent starts. The pitcher is attempting to show that 2022 was only an unanticipated hiccup in the path and not an indication of things to come. Barrios did not get his reputation by mistake. Please leave a comment and let us know if you think Barrios can still be relevant for the Blue Jays this season, or if he'll likely just repeat the weak season he had in 2022. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any of the latest Blue Jays news. Thanks for watching.